Zach Moray, K Blue Spark 107 here, just immediately back into Undertale, because I'm going to go ahead and record the second episode. Because when I ended that first one, then I'm going to hit the second one. Or, so they're just out of the way. So, right, it's the normal things. <sighs> now we're leaving Toriel, and we're going down the corridor. Where will we end up next? It's also kind of cold in here. I kind of want to instinctively put my hood up, but I don't want to do that because I want you guys to actually be able to see my face. Okay, what the fuck? Really? <coughs> clever. Very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. I don't think so. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spare the life of a single person. Hehehe. <laughs> But don't act so cocky. I know what you did. What? You murdered her. And then you went back because you regretted it. Shut the fuck up! Ha 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 ha. You naive idiot. It's it's surprising how the characters know exactly what you did and what you went to do to go back to, you know, fix your mistakes. Do you think you are the only one with that power? The power to reshape the world purely by your own determination? The ability to play God. That's a pretty deep uh, motivation there. It's a pretty deep motive for you to say. The ability to save. I thought I was the only one with that power, but I can't save anymore. Apparently your desire for this world overrides mine. Well, well. Enjoy that power while you can. I'll be watching. This is a very freaky as fuck flower. Okay, what the shit? Seriously, what the fuck is wrong with that thing? Oh, so that's the o actual opening. No oh, fuck. By Toby Fox. I'm gonna move that mouse. It's still bugging me. Moving into the forest. It, just, it kind of reminds me of Cry of Fear, except those are completely different games. This is not technically a horror game. And Cry of Fear is. Oh, there's something behind me. Just keep running. Keep running, Jesse. I'm trying to do a Zide Missani impression. I'm not exactly sure I did it. What the frick? Why am I stopping? Oh, I think I know who that is. Human, don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Uh, what? Uh, well, hi there. It sands. What the fuck? <laughs> Your whoopee cushion in the hand trick. Oh, 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 oh. oh, you're a funny one. It's always funny. I I'm trying to do a good thing. Anyway, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I want to make this my personal Sans impression. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for human rights. I'm for humans right now. But... You know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus, is a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I'm like, go, go through the gate. Yeah, go in. Our bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Uh, why that conveniently shaped lamp? Sup, bro? You know what's up, bro? Brother? I don't. Okay. I should try to do my skeleton voice, actually, because that's pretty much the virus. <laughs> sort of checks the page. It's been eight days, and you still haven't really calibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at the slam. It's really cool. Do you want to look? No! 
I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. <laughs> this is just funny. It's real funny. It's just stomping on the ground. Stomping on the ground. What are you doing, man? He's having a temper tantrum. <laughs> That's not a forced laugh, by the way. I don't really laugh a lot. I will capture a human! And I, the Great Papyrus! I'm, again, trying to like Jackson, okay? Just because I know how he does it. I don't watch the Undertale playthroughs, but I just know how he does it. Because he does it on, you know, vlogs and whatnot. Look at all the things I really deserve! I kind of removed the U from this, so. Respect! Recognition! I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard! <laughs> Keeps flying around in the wings. People will ask to be my friend! I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning! Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you! Helping you lazy bones! All you do is sit and boondoggle! You get lazier and lazier every day! He's doing the foot thing again. Hey, take it easy! I've gotten a ton of work done today! A skeleton! <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so perfect! Sorry, I need to take a drink real quick before I continue this. I'm kind of staring at myself too much, too. Ha! Sans! Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it! Someone as great as me had to do so much just to get some recognition. Wow. You're pretty narcissistic there. Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. <laughs> Stop it! Uh, uh, these guys are actually kind of as funny as uh, people say. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> if you guys think I'm trying to copy Jack's guy way too much with my papyrus impression, please let me know in the comments. I'll try to do it my original spin. But at the same time, I'm probably just going to do Skeletor slash Jackson guy. No, no, he was saying, ha! Okay, you can come out now. <laughs> okay, so now I can, like, actually come over and talk to him. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. <laughs> actually, hey, hate to bother you, but could you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before. Pardon. And seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks, Billy. I'll be up ahead. Okay, good save point. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. 6531, huh? It's already been an hour. Hmm. What's this? Use the box? Well, yeah, it's a box. Oh, it's an inventory box! What's, what's Tough Glove do? Hmm. Shut up, phone! What is it this time? Uh, another email, and there was also a YouTube notification. Alright, uh, someone's just updating their story that I don't really read. Oh, and Lord Minion 777 also. 
uploaded a Dark Souls 3 video. I haven't actually been watching stuff about Dark Souls at all because I want to try and go in there as blind as possible. I've only been able to play through a little bit of the beginning on my Xbox when I played the game. Info. Tough glove. Weapon. Attack 5. A worn pink leather glove for five-fingered folk. I... Actually, I don't think I need that. I'm not trying to attack people. Uh, what's what the fuck? I'm, I don't even know. I don't want to deal with it right now. What's up here? A uh, fishing pole. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in. Sure. All that's attached to the end is a photo of a weird-looking monster. Call me! Here's my number! You decide not to call. That's... kind of weird. So, as I was saying about Undyne... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my gosh, they're spinning! Too. Sans, I finally did it! I'm dying, Will! I'm gonna... I'll be so popular! 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 I really hope that my voice is not annoying my aunt and uncle. That went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's continue. That was funny, though. Like, now I can understand why everyone likes him. Ice cap. That's a compliment. You inform Ice Cap that it has a great hat. Envious. Too bad. Whoa. 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 Woo! Ice Cap, make sure his hat is still there. Where's your hat? I don't know. Whoa. Ow. Ow. That's... I just love my hat, okay? I'm kind of doing up a pirate poster. Whoa. Oh, whoa. That's a new close smell. You can form ice cap that has a great hat. Yeah, wait, I've already done that. I don't know how to defeat him yet, so I'm just gonna escape. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you ponder? I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. Nope, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. <laughs> I figured as much as it was papyrus. Absolutely no moving. I'm gonna move. What the fuck? Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Fuck. What the fuck is this thing? Don't move an inch. Oh, 
Okay. Don't move an inch. Will it move this time? No, I'm not gonna move. Unless, of course, your attack somehow actually hurts me. So good. Really still in the mood to put on my hood though, apparently. No plans to fight these guys. Come on. Anytime now. I just not. I, mean, I really hope that I do actually just have to repeat this and I'm not making a fool of my, a fool of myself. Alright, check the other options though. Check pet. Pet would probably be a bad move. I'll try it anyways. You pet doggo. What? I've been pet! Okay, now don't move. Yes! Okay. So I was making a huge mistake. Where's that coming from? <laughs> There's no end to it! <laughs> oh my gosh, this is a this is a very funny character. I'm gonna pet him again. Well, this is thorough! Wow. Okay, that's enough. Alright. If that's enough, yes! I spared him. Zero XP, 30 gold. Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Alright, go quickly, quickly, quickly. Hi, Sans. Hey! Here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Very neat trick, especially since I learned that from Doggo. I think his name was Doggo. Oh, I'm sliding. I'm sliding. Alright, let's see if I can slide into that sign. I just want to be able to read it. North Ice, South Ice, West Ice, East Snowden Town, and Ice. What's up here? A snowman. Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please. Take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Okay. Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. Well, that's very interesting. Okay. You're so lazy! You were napping all night? Excuses. Oh, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? The amount of fun you probably will have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. <laughs> Sans, what did you do? <laughs> I think the human has to hold 
Yogi Orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Okay, try it now. That'll be easy. I'm gonna take it slow, though. Just a little bit. Incredible! You slippery snail! <laughs> You solved it so easily! Too easily! Yeah, you... Yeah, I'm, I'm just... Intelligent. However... The next puzzle will not be easy! It is designed by my brother, Sans! You will surely be confounded! I know I am! <laughs> This seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? He made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He's calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Yeah, he's cool. Kind of a dork. What the fuck is that? Is that a goat? I'm gonna say it's a goat. I don't understand why these aren't sailing. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Uh, actually, no. You would be able to sell hot chocolate during this time, and I would definitely go for some hot chocolate, even in the summer weather, because hot chocolate is amazing. But ice cream is much better for summer. Oh, a customer. Hello. Would you like some ice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold. Oh, okay, so it's saying it's 66, I uh, have 66 gold, and there's one out of eight spaces. You know what, just because I want to be a nice guy, I will buy some of your nice cream. Here you go, have a super duper day. You got the nice cream. I'm kind of like trying to do my papyrus voice, it seems. Okay, there we go, I was stuck for some odd reason. What the? What did I do? Oh, oh, it's a puzzle! What about this way? No, 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 no. Oh, crap! On, let, let's move it away from this area. It's shrinking. Okay, well, we gotta get it this way. Maybe to the ice? Oh no, to the hole. Oh crap. No. Oh, oh come on, you're almost there. Ah, oh, damn it. Alright, so I gotta knock it into that hole. Before it melts. I got it now. No! Crap! Other way! Yes, go this way. Oh, come on! No, 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 don't go backwards. You must go forward. No, crap. No, no! Oh, shit. I'm doing it wrong. No! No, no! No. This way. No, this... Yeah, kind of this way. No. Shit. Okay, there we go. No, oh, it's gone. This is probably gonna take a bit. Alright, so yeah, this way. This way. I'll hit it this way. Oh, come on, this No. Yeah, that way. Snowball. Actually, it's a snow de chandron. What? Alright, let's go talk to Sans over here. If he's talkable. Yay! 
Yeah, I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just five gold. Fried snow. That's not how that works. That's not how any of this works. Fuck it. Be nice. Okay, now I'm not doing it. You're right. That's still too low. Smell danger rating. Snow smell, snowman. White rating can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell, puppy. Blue rating, smell of ro rolling around. Weird smell, human. Green rating, destroy at all costs. Uh, what? Check this way. I mean, I know there's a snowball and everything. Norman, I hope you're ready for... Stands, where's the puzzle? It's right there. On the ground. Just, there's no way they can get past this one. Monster Kids Word Search. <laughs> hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Fall, winter, spring, summer, monster skeletons, mermaid, robots, scars, sig. Okay, so how do I solve it? Do I use mouse? Uh, how do I solve it? Sans, that didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that! In my opinion, Junior Jumbo is the easily the hardest. What? Really, dude? That easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human! Solve this dispute! Which is harder, jumble or crossword? Crossword. That's a word search, actually. Crossword is like from the scene from Hot Fuzz. Fascist. Hag. Okay. Uh, what is harder? What is the jumble? You know what? I just want to agree with Sam um, with uh, Papyrus just to see how he reacts. Humans must be very intelligent. You may also find Junior Jumbo so difficult. Okay, my voice is kind of like going here and there. It's weird. <laughs> nice for saying Junior Jumbo just to appease my brother. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and save. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up, um, to heat up the spaghetti. It fills you with determination. 8447. Okay, well, once we save and it says like 120 or something like that. It's a note from Paris. Norman, please enjoy the spaghetti! Little do you know, the spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed again by the great papyrus. <laughs> Papyrus. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. It's an unplugged microwave. All of a sudden, you say spaghetti. <laughs> yeah, I can't eat it if it's frozen, Papyrus. Warning. Dog marriage. What? What? When has a dog ever gotten married? <sighs> okay. Can I do anything with these? No. Nope. They're just there to be there. Oh, there's a trap. Hmm? Uh oh. A lesser dog appears. Heck! Barely lifted your hand unless the dog got excited. Oh. 
politely touch the dog. It's already overexcited. Ooh. Whoa! <laughs> oh! That's good! That is rich! Pet the dog, it raises its head up to meet your hand. <laughs> nope, no, no. You pet the dog, it was a good dog. <laughs> Ow! Now you surprised me. You pet the dog, it's excitement, knows no bounds. Now I will spare you. Alright, so there's something in the snow. Let's try and clear it. Come on. Alright, well, let's do this the correct way. Dealing with this right now, especially since I saw an alien. All right, but there's something I need to pull over here. Maybe there's something I need to do though. That map is any indication. <laughs> Jerry. There's gotta be a way to cross this puzzle, and it says something about this spot in the middle. Oh, there's a switch hidden in the snow. Ah, oh, click. Alright, I get it now. Let's go! Oh, uh, well, what the frig? What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. Fuck. Hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Uh oh. We are in a fight. Dog me, dog Arisa. Wait, are they girls? I don't know. Dogs choose the sisters of your smell. Paws off the smelly human. That's not your husband, okay? Oh, okay, never mind. Whoa. Ow. How? How was I supposed to get through that? Look nice today. Your HP was maxed out. Yay! Thank you, nice cream guy. Take my wife's, please. Don't actually. What? Ow.
Come up right now, phone. Finally! Oh my gosh! What did you really think was so important, email? Huh? Get out of my face. I don't want to deal with you right now. Okay. Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us! Thanks, weird puppy! <sighs> About fucking time. That's the sixth time I've done that. It's gonna be cut down so that you don't see it. Turn every X into an O, and then press the switch. Why do that? Oh. <laughs> yeah, these puzzles aren't too hard. What? RNG. <coughs> Sorry, I got something really neat there. Some bile or whatever. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Yeah, I left it. Really? Wowie! You resisted the flavor of my home cooked pasta. Just so you could share it with me? Fret not, human. I Master Chef Papyrus! Make you all the pasta you could ever want! Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> uh, he's very interesting. <clears throat> My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> Human! Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so... I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, Worry not, human! I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try to puzzle yourself. I'll try not to get away... to give away the answer. Turn every X into a no, then press the switch. Nope, same. Okay. Okay. What? No. Or maybe? I'll try walking over them again. No, they won't change. Which is weird. Alright, let's try pressing the switch. And it resets. Ah. So I have to go through them all and only trigger them once. Yes, I'm pretty intelligent. <coughs> I like to think, at least. 
Apparently, though, my IQ is like around 108. I took a test about it. Which is weird. And you did it all without my help! Incredible! I'm impressed! You must care about puzzles like I do! Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then! It might even be too easy for you! <laughs> uh, okay, there we go. Now I can move. Or not. Okay, yeah, now. I want to wait until I'm across the trap. Good job, I'm solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. It's Diamond! You're gonna love this puzzle! It was made by the great Dr. Alphys! You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious! Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you! Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells only like lemons! Which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay! Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Understand the explanation, of course. Great! Then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. <laughs> Get ready! Oh, it's still doing. Okay. Weird epilepsy warning right there. <laughs> oh, Papyrus is just spinning out of there. I literally thought I was going to have some kind of dangerous situation. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. Uh, there's a cow over there. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. Oh, 95.36. Okay. Hmm, where are you? A dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. Its neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until it was rather sad to watch. But I couldn't turn away. Hmm. Uh, okay, yeah, I can still move. Oh, no. Whoa! It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sands written on it in a red marker. Okay. Alright, so... Gotta get all these. Shit. Good news is, though, I just get tossed back here. Okay, so how do I do this? the difficult part. Oh, 
Alright, throw myself off real quick. I gotta get those middle ones, but I don't know how. If I get these ones, it's easy. Oh, wait. I got it this time. I figured it out. Where am I going now, though? Oh, okay. I was sliding, I guess. What's this way? Hmm. Woof. Really? That's all I gotta say? Uh... Hi. Oh, never mind. Shit. It's the greater dog. Greater dog is too far away to pet. You just pet the air. Oh my god. That's... that's cheap. You call the greater dog. It bounds towards you, flicking slobber into your face. Now let's see if I can pet it. Greater dog curls up in your lap as it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable, it falls asleep. Then it wakes up! It's so excited. Bark. You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now dog is very tired. It rests his head on you. Greater dog wants some TLC. Whoa! Okay. Those words can't actually hurt you. As you pet the dog, it sits its entire weight into you. Your movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Oh. Ow! Stop it! Oh, shit. When was the last time I saved? It was very recent. I remember. Oh, fuck. solve this puzzle. I'm gonna check down here real quick, actually. Yeah, there's sands. What's up? Following me. I don't know what I'm doing actually. No time to deal with you. What is this? That's a cave. Well, this is different. It's a door. Something's going on. Can't do anything with that door. Okay. I guess I'm gonna have to do something with it later, though. Hmm. Oh. Sans is following me. Well, like, his eyes were following me for a second. Alright, we know what that sign says. Alright. So, let's try to... Let's not fight the dog. Come here, puppy. <laughs> bark, bark. Bark, bark. 
There we go. <laughs> bark, bark. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. and he reaches 100%. Dog flops over with his legs hanging in the air. Greater okay. dog is contended. I shall spare you, good doggy. are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. This method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. You! What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus! kind of understand it. Hey, look at that. Welcome to Snowden. I want to figure out what kind of reference it is. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. File saved. Hmm. You know what? I think I want to go ahead and save here because it's about 5 o'clock. Uh, yeah, it's literally about 5 o'clock according to that clock, but that clock's like a minute ahead. So I'm gonna go ahead and stop here since it did just save. I wanna give my voice a bit of a rest, but I'll probably try to record two more episodes like tomorrow or the next day, uh, and around there, maybe. But if you guys are enjoying this, of course, you may do the usual accolades I ask of you. If Robert and Trevor are definitely enjoying it, comment about it. Give me some comments, some advice maybe. Just, you know, I'm doing this for you guys, so you need to actually give me some attention. So that way I know that you guys are watching and you are enjoying it. So thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace out, Spartans. Down here, love is shared too. Yeah. Middle white. Friendliness petals. Are you ready? Move around. Do as many as you can. I am not touching the petals. Hey buddy, you missed them. I know. Let's try again, okay? <laughs> Is this a joke? Are you 